Merry fucking Christmas. I got something under the tree for you, asshole. Santa's got a raging hard on for you, baby. Why don't you take my Yule log up your chimney? Suck my North Pole, baby. You looking at me, asshole? Merry Christmas. Fuck off, asswipe. Come on and sit on Santa's lap. Naughty little girls make my Saint Nick stand in tension. Ho, ho, ho. Merry ball, motherfucker. What are you looking at? Shit head, shit head, shit head, shit head. Let's do it two way. This claws likes it nasty. Suck my reindeer dick. Bend over and let me fill your sock with my stomping. Have a great holiday season. Hello? Hi, Karen. Oh, hi, Meg. I can't talk right now. Hello? Listen to me carefully. You were to put two million in unmarked, untraceable bills in the trunk of the red Mini Cooper. And they actually went to Hills Mall on Sunday morning at precisely 9 a.m. You were then to go straight home and wait for instructions on where to collect your whining, miserable son. I see any cops, the deal's off, and Barkley's dead. I need to talk to him before I deal with you. He's fine. I want to talk to him. I want to talk to my son. Out of this. Get me out of here, Mom. Got it. We're going to Barkley. I sent your parents a severed human thumb. You sent my parents a thumb. Well, did you really think we'd get their undivided attention with just a picture of you holding a newspaper? Whose thumb? Look, if I had actually cut off your thumb, you would have been bloody. You would have been hysterical and completely useless to me as a partner. It's OK to eat the dead, but not to amputate a finger. Confusing set of rules you live by, Barkley. I'm going to hell for this. Hell is for children. What? That Benatar. They let us trace them, then they're sloppy. Let's go, guys. What exactly does that mean? Barkley lost his thumb. I thought we already knew that. So here's how it's going to go. While your father is pacing in his living room, wondering if life is better without you, passing his finest will storm the wrong house. All right, stand down. We've uh, made a mistake. Meanwhile, at the mall... God damn it. I told him, no merchandise deliveries until we finish the frame. What am I gonna do with all this shit? Construction crew is just looking forward to a few Saturday night brews with the boys and Sunday off with the kids. No, 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 no. I got this, folks. The Mini was lowered into the atrium by a helicopter. While the police devise an offensive so as not to be humiliated. Again. From where it sits, there's no driving it out of there. There's no access and no doorway that's wide enough to drive through. At exactly 7.45 a.m., the southwest doors will open for employees only. That leaves me with approximately one hour to rebuild the car. No, I got nothing. Under no circumstances do we reveal ourselves as officers of the law. Barkley Michelson's life depends upon our precision and restraint.
fuck's he doing? Fuck if I know. Hey, no! Go get him. Feel comfortable carrying it across a mall and leaving it in the trunk of a car that thousands of people are tossing raffle tickets into. It's everything we have, Sarah. It is not everything we have. We have our son, who we love more than any amount of money in the world. There are no alternatives, Eli. Sarah. Damn it. I'll tell you. It's lonely at the top, sir. You're lucky I'm not a genius. We'll get your son back alive, Dr. Michelson. We're all genius. At exactly 9 a.m., you will join the other 200 screaming families as they enter and try to be the first 100 to receive their free MP3s. Once the drop is made, let the fun begin. Driving. 